Hi friends, welcome back to the channel Sidekicker. In this, I'm going to do the speed test and RAM management test comparison between the Realme GT Master Edition versus iQOO Z5 device. And during this time of testing, I'll try to use 10 applications only, friends, not games, just only applications. Let's see which phone will be able to uh, load the applications faster and which phone will be having really good RAM management. That's what I'm going to exactly demonstrate in this video. The Realme GT has got the Snapdragon 778G processor and with the Realme UI and iQOO Z5, which has got the Snapdragon 778G but with the Font Touch UI. So both phones are having similar kind of processors but different kind of uh, UI. So let's see which UI is really optimized for better kind of RAM management and better kind of speed test. Let me need to quickly open the Wi-Fi connection between these both phones just to get you know. So both phones should be connected to the same kind of Wi-Fi network. Yep. Yeah, now it's kind of visible. So 2.4 gigahertz and 2.4 gigahertz. As you can clearly see. And I'm trying to use the external rank capabilities as well in the iQOO Z5 and even in the Realme GT Master Edition also the external rank capabilities is turned on at this moment. As you can clearly see friends, external rank capabilities is on. So these are the 10 basic applications which we do use every day. So that's the reason I thought of including these applications particularly in this video. Let's see which phone can actually load and uh, open them fast and which phone can actually store them in the background RAM management. So let me need to clear everything from the FIFA. Yes. Let's start with the first application which is a Chrome. And the loading speed, the iQOO Z5 did load slightly faster than the Realme GT Master Edition. This is a touch sampling rate application. And I'm trying to draw some lines to keep them in the background RAM management. Even in the Realme GT Master Edition also, I'm trying to draw some lines. And this is the application which will be really interesting to test the RAM management. That's the reason friends, I did include that application particularly. Next is uh, Amazon Prime videos. So both loaded very close to each other, nothing much huge difference. And uh, let's see the Amazon application. This is a shopping application. Let's keep this in the background RAM management. Next is a Flipkart. Flipkart, let's go to the mobile section and let's load the random mobile which is iPhone 12 maybe let's keep in the background RAM management or I just want to keep them so yes next is YouTube so it's a YouTube which has been opened right now as you can clearly see let's open my channel right now I'll try to keep this in the background RAM management next is a fast application which is also another speed test application so which will we'll try to keep this result in the background so I just want to keep this in the background but right now the iQOO Z5 was able to get the Wi-Fi most of the Wi-Fi but not the Realme GT Master Edition it's kind of alternate test we need to do one by one but I'll try just keep this score in the background RAM management just both these numbers and next is Mintra so let's keep this man yep so I'll keep them in the background and next is the Play Store Play Store let's keep this Pokemon yep finally is a kind master video rendering application so during this time I'll try to render uh, one video let's let me to quickly open I'll try export let's do the video export at same time so rendering speed test will be able to measure it as well so deleting the previous rendering files that will give us some kind of space anyway so right now as you can see friends, both phones are estimated size of close to 222 MB, 222 MB. Exactly, same file size estimated size. Now let me do, uh, do the, so from 10, 1080 video clip, I'm trying to convert into the 1080 video clip. So same conversion, let's see, which can actually convert faster. One, two, and three. So there's no GT mode, there's no monster mode, nothing is enabled. Both are having the same kind of Snapdragon 778G processor. This should be kind of very close to close results. Nothing much huge uh, sub surprise, it should be there at this point. But let's see what happens right now which can actually load fast so right now as you can see friends both phones are getting close to the end of the results and first phone to finish is the iqoo z5 so iqoo z5 just just a little bit just a little bit did finish faster but not a huge difference i would say anyway but right now we did finish the speed test comparison between both phones so all the 10 applications are completely open in the background RAM management as you can see friends clearly everything completely is open right right now in the background RAM management now we're going to open one by one applications let's see how many applications can be there in the background RAM management between these both phones and is uh, let's start from the last applications let's see so till now no issues and same results we are getting and YouTube also my page is there exactly so five applications no issues between these both phones next is a Flipkart Flipkart also no issues Amazon application some issue in the realme gt master edition it did go to the home page but where is the iqoo z5 was able to keep exactly in the page so no issues with iqoo z5 
So Realme GT Master Edition did get about six applications, six applications. That's kind of slightly kind of uh, strange. It's not games, it's applications. So we need to note down. And next is a uh, Amazon Prime videos as well. Let's open the Amazon Prime. Tom and Jerry. And it's there in the background. Even Realme GT Master Edition also there in the background. No problem. And let's try. Next is touch sampling rate application. You will be able to see these lines, right? You can see the small lines in this phone and big lines. And I could see if I was able to store exactly no issues. So overall friends, the RAM management is slightly kind of better in the Iqoo Z5 device. If you ask me, definitely not. Not only in this phone, even in the Iqoo Z3, which I used before, Iqoo Z3 and even the Iqoo 7, those phones also they do have a really good uh, RAM management in the Fun Touch UI when compared with the Realme UI. So this friends is a quick comparison between both phones and stay tuned for more updates in case if you're having any other queries, let me know in the conversation below. Meanwhile. Signing off friends and the final winner is Iqoo Z5 device in terms of the speed test and the RAM management test as well. Meanwhile signing off, bye.